Uh, how you doing? Um, it's Hefty. You're watching 100% from the area. <laughs> Yo, 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 what's up everyone? How you doing, Nat? What's going on? I'm Mo from the area. Welcome to 100% from the area podcast, Nat. The best and hectic podcast, Nat, in the area. Only from the area to the area with people from the area who are doing it big and that. And that, today's guest and that is like beyond amazing and that. Like a brother who's been there, done that. He's parted, he's parted and that. All over and that. Like, you know, on the boats, he's done this, he's done that. You know, he's told he's told it to come through. He's been with one of the hecticest groups and that, you know, to it done what he's done and that. But now he's doing his own thing and that. Ladies and gentlemen, the man from all the way from the area and that, from the six one, the one and only, my brother, Hefty Six One. Uh, What's up, bro? Up to it, up to it. What's going on, bro? <laughs> yeah, good, bro? Thanks for coming on the show and that, bro. Nah, nah, it's all good, man. Straight it's out. Good to, it's um, all good, bro. It's good to have you on, bro. So, um, it's been a while since we... Yeah, the last one, eh? Yeah, yeah, the yeah, last one man. and that, bro. So Straight out. Yeah, bro. Um, And how you doing, bro? How are you? Nah, yeah, I'm all good, bro. Just chilling out. Fucking uh, working on new music and that. You know, I just dropped a song, mm. My Way. That's what's up. Yeah, bro. Yeah. And um, how's that going for you, like the song, My Way? Nah, yeah, it's going good. Uh, getting mad love from everyone and that, you know. Even uh, guys from different areas, you know, yeah. 27, uh, Campbelltown ways. Uh, it's just got mad love from everyone and that. It's hectic, straight up. Yeah, bro. Um, and um, I watched the song and everything. It's pretty, um, it's different to what you usually do. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Can you tell us about that? There's a lot of truth behind it. Um, you know, it's not, yeah. Do, do you oh, want to tell us more like about it? Behind the song, that, yeah, it's about how I grew up in that, you know, um, what I went through and, like, what I'm trying to tell these young kids out there, like, fuck, it's, you know, it's pretty shit, bro, you know. You can't really go out there, you know, chill out, just go anywhere. You can't go to different areas without your oil base and that. Um, you know, you, you always have to watch your back and shit. It's a shit life to live, but hey, you know, I got into it and fuck, now I just lay in my bed, you know, got to deal with it. So, so you're dropping some truth now, and because a lot of kids look up to a lot of rappers, as yeah. you know, like yourself and, and many others, and, um, you know, and, and people would say, you know, it's all good and everything. Like you're rapping about this and areas and postcodes and oh, blah, yeah. blah blah. Oh, you know? bro, to be honest, bro, all that fucking area stuff. That's all bullshit, bro. Straight out. You know, um, when you're in there and you talk to the olders, but a lot of them don't give two fucks about this beef shit. They look at us young kids and go, "Fuck, you're all little gronks. Just go out there and make money. That's what this game's about." You know what I mean? Um, fucking oh, Once I started figuring out all that shit I was like fuck You mean to tell me all that shit is all bullshit You know But fuck that's something you gotta learn on your own But me with this music shit That's why I wanna you know push for And tell these kids like fuck The reason why we jump into it is Like it's for the money in that You know we wanna help our family out and shit You know we don't want our parents working. Well, yeah, it's not a good way to get money, but fuck. You know, it, it is what it is. Yeah. You have to do what you have to do out on the streets and shit. But fucking... They, but there will always be, you know, dramas with different areas. There will always be dramas, but... It's all these young kids, like... They think that's all that this shit's about. You have to hate this area in order to, you know, fit in and that. Yeah, you have to hate this kind me personally i have dramas with a person from that area doesn't mean i'll beef with the whole area you know what i mean yeah because rab but let's be real by the end of the day you know area is just the area people live there every like you know yeah. people from all walks of life and everyone lives in that area so uh you know for me you to hate someone from 
example, the 27 yeah. or any other area, um, it just doesn't make sense. Like, how, how could I hate someone f for an area? Like, I, I don't know the area to hate or whatever. Like, because that area... No, might, we don't even own the area. Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly, exactly. <laughs> we we don't even... Like, yeah, hell. like, most of us don't even own our houses or whatever. Do you hear me? Like, we're <laughs> trying to make ends meet in that, eh? Like, like nah, we don't own nothing. Man. And people claiming, oh, this is my area. You can't come here and do stuff. But, but this, you know, this, this rap thing you know that this rap music thing it's um it's shown there's a lot of talent you know within the community you oh, know yeah, uh, especially yeah, with yeah, the no, polynesians let's be real bro like yeah, it's, everyone's coming out and it's motivated everyone like the guys that started it and then everything like it's like a dominoes effect people coming out like yeah. every second day bro there's a new rapper coming out and stuff but that's great bro it's good because it's given everyone like that the, the, the balls and everything to say, you know what? I can follow my dream. I can become a rapper. And, and you, like, you, you know, and you're saying that. Oh, fuck, man. I'll tell you one thing. You know, bro, you know with a lot of these rappers coming out, a lot of them all talk shit, bro, straight out. 100%. <laughs> no, no, 100%. Uh, you know, they, they're talking there's a lot about of shit. Fakers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. Like, uh, they're talking about all that shit. And, but, bro, they talk about the deeper shit behind yeah, yeah. it. You know what I mean? They're trying to glorify it. Yeah, I did some songs that made it look like I was glorifying the life that I was, that I'm in and shit, you know? But, Fucking um, but there's some dark shit that happens, you know, when you're not with the oil base and that. Like, yeah. but you, you think about your life and that, and you're like, fuck. Yeah, it's just the way I'm gonna be living all my life, you know. Yeah, because you, you um, you know, you, you, you seem to me, bro. That is that. It's almost like you, you've awakened, bro. Like you know, you've, yeah. you know, you, you've seen the light, so to speak. Yeah, like you've, you've kind of looked around and like. Because with all of this, and you know, because you were in the in the youngins in the Sydney youngins group, and yeah, that's one of the hottest groups, you know, to come out of Sydney, and and you guys were doing big numbers, and you know, getting popular, and the music's banging in that, and um, but what people want to know, and what I've been reading online, and people are dying to know, curiosity, always asking, you know, even like on your new song and that, why did he leave the Sydney youngins? People want to know, bro. Like, tell them now. Yeah. Like, like, why'd you leave the group? Like, why? If if you want to elaborate, oh, tell them. Go, bro. Fuck. The reason why I left, <laughs> but to be honest, I just wanted to do my own thing. You know, um, feel like there was bigger messages to get out there than just following the wave and that. You know, and um, there's like more real shit that needs to be told out there on the streets. Oh, like to all these young kids. I mean, you know what I mean. Even um, like all these church kids, like see a couple of them, they want to be this and that, but bro, yeah, bro, like, you're, you're a good kid, stay that way, you know. Yeah, fuck, yeah, 100%, man, hundred percent. Like you, you, you go, you go to church and stuff, and and be holy and and, and godly and everything, and and be positive. That's the that's the way to go. Even like well, when it comes to. Um, you know, sisters and all that, you know, trying to do all this TikTok stuff and that negative ho ho stuff and that, you know, like even that stuff, like have respect and stuff for yourself and that and be, you know, because er everyone comes from, because, you know, you all come from good families and that, eh? like everyone comes from yeah. good families um, and, and morals yeah. and, you know, yeah, like, yeah. a lot of people have ups and downs and, you know, oh, like, yeah, yeah, you yeah, know, always and, ups and downs and that, know, but, but like some of these, like, you know, there's actually good kids, like privileged and shit, you know what I mean? And then they, they want to wish that they lived this kind of life, but fuck, cuz, are you sweet? Like, fuck, do you see the yeah. way that we are? Yeah, yeah, 100%. I don't think you, like, do you see the shit that we have to go through? Because yeah. we'll be eating, you know, we'll be eating out, and we'll still have to look around, you know? Yeah. Like, oh, fuck, just just remember, boys, what they say in our area. Oh, like, we ain't in, we ain't in our area and that. So just yeah. be careful, you know, there might be guys around the corner or some shit, you know? Just, like, little shit like that. Yeah, yeah. You can't even go out with your family, bro, you know? Because you don't want your family to get involved. Because, um, fuck with me, uh, backstory, bro, I fucking, I played yeah, league growing up in that. Uh, I was in the Parramatta Reps, uh, Manly. I was going uh, into 20s, but then um, I, was already, I was already in the stuff and that, the street stuff and that, but... And then my family got involved. So I finished off a game, um, a game and then... Uh, a couple of boys pulled up, you know, anything, uh, like, anyways, um, pulled out the shank and that, my family was right there. Uh, straight away, I was just fucking, just went in front and then, you know, anything, one, two, three, fucking yeah, yeah. shit happened. But that's what I'm trying to tell these kids, like, fuck, 
you're going to get your family involved. You're going to get everyone that you love involved. So that's why I try to keep my family away from this kind of stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah. Don't don't post them up online and that. It's just, it's just so that I don't get like, caught up in the mix, you know? Yeah, because these little fuckers out here, they're you know, like, oh, fuck that, we'll go for your family. Yeah, there's, there's, there's you know no what I mean? But I'll fuck, yeah, yeah, there's no fine. rules in the game, but yeah, fuck, yeah. do that, I'll fuck pump you kind of. Yeah, exactly. So, <laughs> so, so, yeah, don't, you know, you get into this street shit and then, and then you know, um, th there's no moral compass. There's no, like, but people don't care. Like, it's like, oh, yeah, like. I'm having a beef with you, but all of a sudden I'm gonna go after your family. You know, yeah, like, I'm yeah, gonna go. Yeah. After. That's not the way. Like, yeah. we sort it out or whatnot, but we don't even have to be going down that road because you and me are the same. You know, like we don't. You know, we're in that same struggle. We're just trying to get it. So, um, what you're trying to say, and people that are watching that understand that where he's coming from, he's coming from a place where he gives a fuck. Like he actually gives a fuck straight up. Like all jokes aside, and that he gives a fuck. You know he cares. So that's why he's saying it. Like he's he's woken up, and he sees it. He sees all the bullshit in that. Because by the end of the day, you know you can come out with all these songs, all the boys and that. I'm gonna do this to rep the area and that. And there's nothing wrong with ripping your area. Be, be proud of who you are. Because there's people in your area that are going through something that you can inspire. But rather than beef with that area, why don't you come together with this area and do something and let's, for the greater good yeah. of the community, yeah, you know? 100%, man. And I, no, and I commend you, bro. Like, it's it's good that you're, that, you know, I, I didn't see that coming from you, so that's... Yeah. <laughs> I don't think a lot of people saw that, man. Yeah, bro. No, no, 100%, but bro. Fuck. It's good, bro. Straight out, there needs to be a change, you know? 100%. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm this way, but it doesn't mean that the guys I'm beefing with will change. And I already know that, and I will never take my guard down. Yeah. But I will still keep pushing this message. I don't give a fuck. You can try and stop me, yeah, get fucked, cunt. Yeah, Shove it up your ass. 100%. You know what I mean? 100%. 100%. Because like, this is fucking... Too many bro. jealous hating dogs out there and sell out <laughs> dogs, bro. Sell out dogs. I oh, know, bro, because they try to stop me and that. But now I'm here with Hefty 6-1, bro. Like, what? You know? I might yeah, do a track man. or something. I don't know. Maybe like, <laughs> I don't know. You never know in the works and that. Hefty's thinking this guy you better shut the man up. Nah, <laughs> nah, you're good to me. Nah, nah. But yeah, bro. No, hundred percent, hundred percent. And um, yeah. So, so you know, and people are curious about like with with the youngins and that. Like, you boys still talking that? Like everything's still going all right? Like, like the like was it mutual? Like, oh, hey guys, I want to go do my own thing. All good. No worries. Do you do you and that and. We're still, you know, because obviously they got another member and stuff, and you know, oh, and yeah. they're still making music. Oh that, fuck! You know? Shout out to Lelly, man. Yeah, fuck, that's my boy, yeah, bro. Yeah, Straight yeah. out, I'm glad he's doing oh, his thing and that. Yeah, nah, everyone support. Like, fuck, go support him, man. He's a real one. Straight out, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll vouch for him. Fuck, he's a sick cunt. Yeah. But yeah, with the leaving and that, oh, I, you know, I told the boys and that I was gonna leave, like months before this was, before I was gonna leave and that. Like I told them way before that. Yeah. And then um. Yeah, after I left, fucking... Yeah, we didn't really talk after that, eh? Yeah. It was just, yeah, I left. So, they do their thing, fuck, proud of them. I hope they fucking kill it, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, keep grinding, bro. That's, all, that's what this game's about. Keep yeah, grinding, man. Cause, 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 you you know, can never hate on another man's grind, bro, because, you know, we all come from the struggle and that. 100%. And, and look, look, it's all brothers and that. Um, You know, the boys at BHQ and, you know... um. Rico's and Tito's and that, like all good guys, you know, I've met them. Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%, 100%. And, and talented and, and, and doing their thing, so, bro, and, you know, and who's to, you know, everyone, you know, everything blows over and everyone can come back together and do stuff, you know, like, yeah, yeah, um, yeah, you, right. you know, like there's always that brotherhood and that, and, um, you know, and, and that's what we want people to know that there's no, you know, thing going on, you know, this person doesn't hate that. Sometimes people yeah, need to do their own thing. Like, it's just the way it goes. Like. The stories, you little yeah, yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah. And sometimes, um, you know, opportunities come and people want to do their own thing and that. there's nothing wrong with that. So yeah, shout out to everyone at BHQ, Divs and that, all the boys and that, you know, because they've done a lot, you know, for you. Yeah, like, nah, straight you, you out. Know, put you on the map, bro. So straight that's, out, that's, man. You know, they did 100%. a lot. Yeah, yeah. Can't, Good guys. Can't forget Good, that, yeah, man. 100%, no, no. And all about that positivity, so... Like, don't be fucking scared to go anywhere, to be honest, man. Straight out. No one owns this area. No one owns that area. If you fucking look at it, we're all owned by Balangis, bro. We're all owned by the white people in that. Straight out. Okay. In the council, they're, all, they're the ones running us, bro. At the end of the day, yeah, we bro. pay taxes. Look, we look, fucking look, uh, work for them. Yeah, bro. Look, uh, it's... Uh, 
I think, yeah, bro, like, yeah, what he said, bro, like, straight out and that, like, yeah, um, but far there goes my career, bro, far, I think the thing's going to get shut down and that, you know, like, yeah, no, no, but 100%, no, what, what he's saying is right, like, um, all the areas, bro, yeah, we don't know enough, like, half of us don't own nothing, bro, like, don't even, like I said, people are trying to make ends meet, living in houses, whatever, yeah. um, you know, like, yeah. like, it's hard, life's hard, bro, so, so if you're going to focus on, you know, kicking out other man, like, we're on the bottom of the barrel and i don't like you know not just like i'm talking to everyone from all these areas but i don't care what your color is or where you're from and that everyone's doing it hard so so the struggle is real bro like everyone's trying to make it in that so why are you gonna kick someone down bro like let's lift each other up to, to make because what one once one makes it in that you know like he can pull his people and that and his mates and that and then from there it can be a dominoes effect and everyone can have jobs now and we can kind of elevate so you know the, you know what i mean it's good bro and then because what I see online, people, you know, picking on this person, oh, he's got no talent, he can't rap, he can't do this. But at least he's having a go, bro. Like, yeah, at least he's having yeah. a go, bro. Good on him, you know. Like, he's doing it, you know. Like, he's having a go. Whatever he does, like, that's what we need, you know. Straight up, bro. Like, all jokes aside and that, you know. Like, yeah, we like to have a laugh, muck around. But seriously, like, people need to support each other. Because if you don't support each other, what's going to happen? Because we need to break that chain, that cycle. Because like you said, bro, we're, all, we're, like, we're on the bottom, bro, and like we're owned in that, bro. We need to rise up in that and just do stuff like for the community, for the people. No, Inspire the young ones, bro. Everyone's just in lock up in that, bro. Like Everyone's just lock up, lock up. All right. Like, do you know what lock up is, bro? Like, being locked <laughs> up? Like, you're yeah. locked up. You can't do nothing. You can't eat. You can't, like, your fingers taken away from you. Like, that's straight up, bro, yeah? Straight up. I can't speak on, like, being in lockup because I've never been there, and I'll be hundred percent with that. But no, no, but but you, you know, got like family I'm, yeah. and friends, I'm like but people, yeah, and, and what that does to everyone, eh? Hey, like no, family, yeah. yeah. What yeah. that does to the parents and that, yeah, like man. the the pain that the the, the, the like, talks that know. we have and that, they're just like, oh, how are you, man? Fuck, miss you and that, you know, just like yeah. little shit like that, like fuck, wish I was there on Christmas and that. But they're like, hey, I chose this life, fuck, you know, gotta lay in my bed. So all all that stuff I got taught from fucking. Family from like older generation, generation before them, and that. So that's why I've got like a different mentality to a couple of the boys from like other areas, and that you know, like with me, my street beef, it's just basically strictly street beef. That's it. So we meet up on the street, yeah, it's done on the street. That's it, done, done and dusted. I, w I won't come to your, you know, I won't come to your house and now, or you know, shit like that. I've always kept it. Whatever happens here, that that's it. it stays there. Fuck, both walk home in that. Yeah, hundred percent. Like you might have that thing drama, and then next time you're not saying, "Hey, bro," he might give you a thing, and you know, and you move on, and hey, you end up being best mates. Like you know, it happens, bro. Yeah, you straight know, like, out. You know, like straight you out. Know, you, man. you just don't know what you got in common. So, but it seems to me, bro, you 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 want to kind of you want to be that leader, bro. Like you want to kind of. You, you want to show the youth the right way like is that oh, yeah, is, is, is that where you're, you're headed man. at bro yeah yeah with the music stuff that's where I want to go uh, just like keep keep giving them like street knowledge and uh, you know messages that are more empowering than saying get caught get shot shut up what is that like speak some truth to these kids you know what I mean like yeah I'm still young but man if you if I can just get one kid that can understand it or if one kid like texts me and that it's like oh hey bro i'm stuck in the game and now you know fuck any of us and that but i'll give it straight away I'll, I'll talk to the cunt because i know what it's like to be young and dumb and not knowing what to do in that no not having direction and shit you know what i mean and um fuck i'll happily talk to any of the young cunts that they want to talk in that you know what i mean well, whatever your whatever area you're from, fuck, bro. I'm always keen for talk, you know, talk about this kind of shit. Yeah. If it helps you out, and that, you know what I mean? Yeah, because a, a lot of kids do look up to you, so you know, and yeah. you know that, yeah, you know, yeah. they look up to you, and and, and they wanna they wanna be like you. So yeah, but you want them to be like you in a good way, yeah. Like you want them, to, yeah, to, oh. yeah, you know, in that positive kind of, you know, <laughs> yeah. no, no, in regards to like like um. Like don't, the music don't and stuff, like, you know what yeah, you're trying to, oh, yeah, 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 like that. Like, oh, hey, I can do it too. You know, he's <laughs> doing it. I can do it. But you know, yeah. you still, you're a street guy. Let's be real. Like you, you're a yeah. street guy. But you can still have a laugh, bro. You can still, you know. Oh yeah, hundred percent, man. Hundred you know, like, percent. Hang out with him and have a laugh and that. You know, yeah. like, you're approachable. You're not, you know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like fuck. 
Oh, don't be like me, yeah. Like, fuck. Just try to be you. You know, if you stay real, fuck. People will love you. But a lot of people will fucking hate you because you're too fucking real for them. You know what I mean? And don't be fucking scared to say whatever the fuck's on your mind. Just be real. Be straight up. Fucking don't give a fuck what you do in life. But 100% make that money, lad, mums. And try try to get your family out of the gutter. 100%. That's the dream, bro. The, yeah, the, 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 the goal is to... Help your family financially. That, that that's real, man. Isn't it? Help your family get your mum out of thing. You know, don't be spending money on crap like uh, drugs, clothes, or, or drugs, or whatever. Or go, you know, because they spend thousands on stuff and that. You know, in one night, and they come home, there's nothing in the fridge. You know, like yeah, man. Like, take your mum to like shops and that. Like, like go to Aldi's or something. Fill up the thing and you know, try a couple of trolls. Yeah. Feed the family. You know, like far. You know, um, and that's yeah, 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 bro. That's that's what you need to do. You know, because cause it's a dominoes effect. Like, you might be doing stuff and that, and you go to jail or whatever. It hurts your family and your loved ones. Don't worry about you because you're locked up. Like, you're in your own world and that, you know, and you're, you've done what you, But everyone, all your mates and all your so-called, everyone, like, what a grunk. You get locked up the first time, second time, third, fourth, and then what? And then what? You know, like, are you stupid? Like, damn. Yeah, straight out. Like, Fuck the thing with my, like, talking about that, you know, yeah. my cousin and that, when he went, to, went inside. Bro, no one's seen him but family. Not even his friends and that. And that's what... That's another thing they got to realise is, oh, fuck. When you're down and out, the only cunts that are going to be there is your family. Oh, all these guys saying, oh, yeah, fuck you, my, you're my brother. My brother, that. yeah, I love you, bro. You know, bro, fuck. You take a, love you, you lad. Take a bullet for you. It's yeah. bullshit, bro. It's, it's all fucking crap at the end of the day, bro. There, there are some real fucking hitties that are with you. There are some real boys that are really down to fucking ride with you. But there's only, what, one or two that will really be down to fucking come see you, you know, come kick it with you. And, like, see you inside and then just have a chat, call you up in that. But majority of the time, it's only family at the end of the day. Even even when your boys backstab you, family's still there to back you up no matter what. You, you know, like you, you turn, you even turn on your parents. You tell them, you know, get stuffed and blah blah this and thing and that, and they'll still come visit you and they'll still put money in for you and that and that yeah. kind of thing just to see. Yeah, you know what man. I mean? And they'll still go out there and they'll travel like hours and hours and that. They'll rent a uh, hotel, or whatever, just to thing with you and that, and you still give them crap. You know, they still give them crap. Nah, you know? straight up. Oh yeah. Also, too, what he said earlier before about the barangay and that. L, uh, we'd say uh, the thing owns the. Bar- would you say the white thing owns owns everything in that? Um, oh, the white people in that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so um, just to make a note, like the producer is white, so it's all good, bro. Like, yeah. you're, you're good, Harry. You're good, Harry. Tor- it's all good. <laughs> Con, come, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right, so, no, yeah, yeah. So it's not, it's not. Yeah, yeah. Just being real. But yeah, bro. Um, so what now? Like in regards to music and that, like you're gonna keep releasing music. What's what's the plan? Like, what's the plan? oh yeah, I'll still keep rele- uh, releasing music and that. Be going on touchy subjects and shit, you know, uh, like men's mental health and that. You know what I mean? Uh, is that important to you, men- mental health and that? Look, oh that, yeah, bro, it plays, a, plays a yeah. big factor in um in this life. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, cause um fucking it'll be shit from you know your childhood, growing yeah. up. You know, um, a lot of trauma. Yeah, yeah, a lot of trauma and that. Ah, uh, fuck. Just... Because like, my childhood growing up, it wasn't really the easiest. Yeah. But my family still pushed my parents in that. Even though, you know, they were on the gear and that. Yeah. We just had to live, like, live with it in that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, Even times when... Fuck, there was 15 of us in the house. Well. But I don't know how the fuck my nana did it. But fuck. She did it. She, she made you know it. Know what I really, mean? She made it work. Yeah. There'll be times where we didn't even have food, but fuck, she'll pull out I don't know anything from the fucking cupboards yeah. and just whip up a fucking hectic feed, bro. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And make sure and everyone fuck, eats. Yeah, bro. Straight out, like seeing all of that just makes me be like, fuck, man. That's the fucking struggle, you know. That's yeah. That's real shit right there. Like, fuck, man. Love my nana for that. May she rest in peace. Rest in peace. And Doing that and seeing that struggle, 
that motivates you to want to succeed now, eh? Like that yeah, makes succeed. you want to also make made me you know? hustle from a young age, you know. Yeah. Also made me hustle from a young age, but I only did it for the money. I didn't do it for the for the beef and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I didn't get caught up in shit just to go fucking start shit with other areas. I did it strictly for the money, and that was it. That was that was my only plan because. You know, growing up like that, fuck man, all shit. But I was wearing clothes like from fucking when I was five years old all the way till I was eight, bro, straight out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but well, it had like, me down. Had, like, stuff, tops, yeah. like, up to you, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so the struggle was, was like, real, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Bro, and I had these fucking all star shoes. Fuck, bro. They were ripped to the max, bro. Like, fucking. So you wore them till they holes, like four. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I still loved them and like now I'm wearing fresh shit, you know? <laughs> But I'm still thank I'm like thankful for everything, bro. Like, yeah. fuck, that made me realize a lot of shit. You know, like, be thankful for what you've got, because, you know, not that much people have that kind of shit. Yeah, like if if you go but if you see certain places in America, like you know, uh, America, like yeah, America or um, you know, say Africa or, or, or just war torn countries and stuff where you know. Yeah. It, it's so hard in that you know like yeah no nah, it's a shit go it, for it, mate. It, it, it doesn't compare to what we have we still have a good here like, yeah you no know, nah, 100 yeah. percent. we still have a good like, man. Like way we, better we than got, like we got, that we got power and, and that electricity yeah. and that like, it's still Fuck, thing, they but can't even like get proper water man like imagine that like you can't yeah. bathe you can't um Fuck. you know yeah, oh, fuck, that's a fucking wash your clothes or be fresh or whatever. Like yeah, no, like 100%, that, man. I reckon all the people here, if you were put them in a third world, I reckon people go crazy. I mean, we're struggling as it is, you know, with the coronavirus yeah, yeah, yeah. and that, we can't, you know? People oh, are going crazy. Nah, straight out, man. You know? Struggle is real. Struggle is real, bro. <laughs> the struggle is real. And we're still struggling till now, bro. So make, oh, sure, you fuck, su- make sure you subscribe in that, please. Like, subscribe. <laughs> like we only got 2K like bro. subscribers now. Like, come on, people. Like, subscribe. What? We get thousands now. Subscribe, bro. Please. Like, tell me, yeah, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. Subscribe. You yeah, can't. Subscribe. You can't. Yeah, that's it. We'll have to come after you in that, I swear. Yeah. Nah, nah, Watch nah. Watch out, nah. you know? Like, we're like a new crew in that. What, what would we call ourselves, FD, if, like, we were like a, say, like a rap group? Like, it'd be. What <laughs> oh, would it be? Like, fuck. think about it. Like, let's go. Oh. What would it be? Fuck, I don't know, eh? <laughs> mo, mo money. <laughs> mo problems. <laughs> mo problems. <laughs> oh, shit. Isn't that Puff Daddy in that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Puff Daddy will sue us. No, no. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Boys in the hood. Yeah, yeah bro. No, for sure. And um, it's good, bro. And uh, you, you want to inspire the youth and, and motivate everyone and, and, and you know, yeah. um, do that for your music, and bro, bro. You should start doing like you can even do like motivational talks, bro. I swear you can go like to schools and areas. I swear, bro. Like with your mindset nah. now, you, <laughs> bro, you can do that. I swear, like for the youth, bro, because there's a big oh, thing one, for that, bro. One day, yeah, bro. You yeah, know, no, like now, hey. you know, hundred percent, bro. <laughs> like there's good money in the two, bro. I swear, like yeah. you can thing, bro. Like you know, that's good, bro. To inspire the youth, but it's good, bro. Like you know, because a lot of people do look up to Hefty. You know, like a lot of people do look up to you, bro. So, you know. Yeah, bro. Anything else you want to add, bro? Like, yeah, just um, fucking backstory on me. Like, you know, um, yeah, my parents were on again that um, we're back and forth in and out of houses and shit. You know what I mean? I uh, grew up around that violence shit. Um, you know, domestic violence and all of that. But hey, I still love my parents now. You know, fuck. They're doing eats right now, fuck man. They're doing heaps good. Come a long way. Yeah, man, straight out. Especially get off the gear now, you know. That's fucking It's not easy, bro. It's yeah. not easy. Like it's 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 tough. Yeah, man. You know, it's it's yeah, people think oh it's They must yeah. have been going through some shit that you know I didn't know of and they, yeah. they still haven't told me now. Yeah. But fuck, I still love my parents, uh, you know, regardless to anything that's 100%. happened. Regardless to all the hidings I got. Oh, shit. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> They're your parents, but, fuck, yeah, no matter what. You know? Even my grandparents and that, fuck, bro, I was still buzzing out, hey, how they did it with all the kids in the house. Fuck, still gets me, bro, like, fucking, how the fuck do you make food? 15 kids in one household. But it'll be crap, like, we laugh at it now, like, because we're older. Yeah. But, very luxury to us was fucking fishing chips, bro, fuck. That was we a big thing, eh? Hey, simple, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. I still love it now, but we should yeah, get, yeah. we should get bread and that, so the fishing chips would be like that and fucking... 
all us kids will be like grabbing like that because you know there's too many of us. Survival of the fittest. Like, each, each scavenging kind yeah, of yeah, thing, yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. Survival of the fittest. Stay like survival, yeah. yeah. But, Survivor. Hey, but, fuck, uh, man. Yeah. You know, that's, that's the way it is. But 100%. we'll be like that, and then fucking my pop will just come around and like, hey, what are you doing? Yeah. He's like, it's free for everyone. And then like you know, just whack us and shit. Yeah. But you know, we're kids. We're like, fuck. We're like, oh, this fish and chips. What the hell? And then try to take everything. Yeah, bro, yeah, we'll yeah. get fucking um, bread, put butter on it, chuck some chips on it, bro. Like, it's and the it's best sandwich, lad. Like. <laughs> and like, when they get like up. sweets and that, like ice cream, because we're like straight up, like mum used to get like chocolates and that and chips and that, but she used to lock it in like the cupboard and that. Oh, and bro, don't worry. My nana did the like, same, bro. Yeah, and try to like unlock it and that, bro. She had like, like these little hiding spots in the pot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, for yeah, the, um, yeah, 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 bro. The Nutella. She used to always oh, put it in the pots and that. Oh, it was like chocolate. I couldn't get my head around like chocolate. Yeah, bro, straight and then, out. And then when you have it like on leopard bread or just bread and that, and you eat it, oh, <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, unbelievable, hard, bro. Hard, hard man. You know? and, and like ice cream, used to fantasize about ice cream and that. Yeah, like, you bro, know, fuck, that was luxury when yeah, we got bro, it, eh, like, man. You know? Fuck, bro, we used to be like, oh, good you, times, good times. You, you sure, Nana, you sure? Yeah, She's yeah. like, hurry up and take it before I take it back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were like, oh, yeah, you know, just fucking pump everything and all the food and that but yeah. our favourite thing to eat bro was boil up fuck man boil up? yeah boil up what's that, bro. It's what's like, that uh, people don't brisket, know what the... you know um, oh like brisket meat and that like yeah meat. yeah oh that's hectic yeah, 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 boil yeah. it up in a thing like in a pot oh the broiler yeah yeah you know, that's the best bro it's, uh, that, it's, yeah. it's well known for Maldives and that bro that that was hectic fuck man even um, there'll be occasions when my nano would make um, chocolate Fucking, what was that? Chocolate pudding, I think it was. Chocolate cake or something? Or? Oh, mud cake. Chocolate oh, mud, mud cake. Oh, mud cake. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. And, and, and you eat the, um when they make the cake mix in that and left on the thing. Yeah, yeah if we used to eat yeah, it. Because yeah. <laughs> I was a fat kid. I used to always hang around my nana. I was like, oh, nana, I reckon I could get some. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I was always time. a fat yeah, yeah. kid hanging around in the yeah, kitchen, yeah, yeah. bro, for just waiting for food and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, man. Even, um, yeah, because food is life, bro. <laughs> yeah, straight out, man. Go, but yeah, that that contributed to a lot of the shit as to why I got into the streets, eh? Even my older cousins and that, you know, fucking, they were teaching me how to sneak into a house when I was fucking, what I think six years old. Oh fuck! Yeah, like they were teaching me how shit. to. Pop, o- pop open a window in that. Oh yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I won't do it, but fuck. Yeah. <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, but. No, nah, I've never done it, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've never done it, but yeah, yeah. Next a lot of it get co- rated, <laughs> but a lot of it contributed to yeah the way I grew up and that as to why I went to the streets. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're a product of your environment, aren't you? Like, but yeah, that's, yeah, that's, man. That's, that's what. Look, some are strong, some can't. You know, some can overcome it, some just go. That's all they know. So it's not. Yeah, you can't blame the person. You know, it's just. The product of the environment, you know. Yeah, no, a hundred percent, man. It's all you look up to, you know. Like, yeah. you know, like, and you know, obviously, saying your cousins were at six years old teaching it to go through a window and that far, bro. It's, <laughs> it's pretty good, bro. Like, but like, you, you know, p- people people look up to, like you said, the older ones that say if they in lock up, they're gonna think. But if if you had cousins or brothers that were, I don't know, went to uni and stuff or businesses yeah, or whatever, you know, you, 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 you go down that path as well. Yeah. So, so sometimes. The kid needs direction, but like you're saying, bro, if 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 they're on the gear and stuff like, it's hard to you know like, yeah. and to figure it out yourself as a kid as well, because like, the kid needs to be taught, because the kid needs the parents yeah. in that age, like the kid, you know, it's hard, and that's why people fall in that you know rut that they get in, you know. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent, man. Oh, like, well, bro, my parents been clean for ages, man. Like, yeah. um, fuck, yeah, how many years now? Fuck, I don't even know. But we were just. You know, they're both working good jobs and that. You know what I mean? Well, shout out to your parents. I mean, they've they yeah. done a good job, bro. Like, you know, with you now. Like, you're yeah. doing good stuff and that. So it's good. Yeah, no, nah, hey, you proud know, of you, you know? learn from you and stuff. Yeah. But, yeah, man, fuck. In a way, I'm kind of glad I went through all of that because it kind of made me, like, it made me the man I am today. Yeah. You know? So I'm glad that I went through all that tough shit to um, be ready for the hard shit in life. You know what I mean? You can't knock a guy down that's already been in the gutter, you know. What exactly, because I mean? you've already been. There's only one yeah. way up, bro. Shit, you know, straight up. up, you know. Like I'm still, I'm still here. 
You know, if I, all of you thinking I'm living a lavish life, like, no way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, I'm uh, still uh, on the struggle, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and a lot of people need to understand, yeah, all the, like, the rappers and that, like, in the area and that, like, it's all, obviously, it's all entertainment and that, but ain't no one, one making, like, you know. We're but, not uh, Americans. Six, six when figures and that. It's not like, you, you know, yeah, it's bro. not like, because yeah, so, like, there's no CDs and that too, bro. Like, people go online and that, but, like, it's all just for free anyway like people don't think so buy some merchandise buy something bro like help brother else they can you know, <laughs> fuck. You know or subscribe uh, subscribe yeah, at least subscribe, subscribe. Like. at least subscribe you know like fuck uh, i just hope the youth they you know that they understand well what kind of message i'm trying to send out to all of them you know I, i'm not really giving a fuck about all the views and that you know i i don't give a fuck if you you hate my shit Straight out, I really don't give a fuck. I've seen the comments. I just yeah. look at it so and laugh. So do you read the comments? Do you read the comments? <laughs> yeah. Do, do, do you read the comments, what people say? Like, say you go through? Yeah. Uh, like, there's a lot of people showing respect on YouTube and that. And yeah. Like, there's always that one dickhead who thinks he's the, you know, oh, I lived this life, I lived that life. Because I really don't give a fuck. Yeah. Because, you know, bro, I'm trying to tell you my side so you, these kids can understand. You know, yeah, yeah. that's the whole point of the fucking song. If you listen, you idiot. You know what I mean? Yeah, because he he's telling his story and he's trying to thing, and you're coming on there saying, "Yeah, you lived whatever this now." But Alex is doing something, bro. Why don't you do something? What do you? What have you done lately, bro? Yeah, what are you yeah, doing? Nah, hundred you percent. Know? What are you doing? Commenting behind your finger, that you know, keyboard yeah. boys and that. <laughs> yeah, nah, hundred percent. That's all they are, bro. That's all they are. But yeah, now nah, shout out to everyone that's showing me love on and loving that from the. Fucking song. Because I was a bit wary about it, eh? I yeah. was like, fuck, I don't know if I like it. But I was like... But now, like, with my music, I fucking love it because it's, it's what I want. It's like what I, what I want to put out there, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's like the kind of messages that I've been wanting to put out since the start. You know what I mean? And it's you, bro. And you're not tied down to anything. So it's more about who you are and you're, you're, you're giving it to everyone. Like, you're saying, this is me. This is who I am. This is what I'm about. And 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 th that's what I wanna. That's what you wanna portray. Yeah, yeah, hundred you, you, you know, percent. And and, and and you feel good about it, yeah. Like you, you, you know, yeah. Is that is that how you feel? Like, do, do you feel good? Like a lot of weights lifted off your shoulders? Oh yeah, no, nah, hundred percent, man. Um, fuck, With, like doing my own thing. Fuck, it's it's been heaps good for me. But like, the hardest thing is like trying to talk about your experience, you know. In life and that, that's the that's the hardest part. But when you overcome all of that shit, fuck, bro, the world is yours and that. You know what I mean? 100%. But like I said, I just want to get that one kid to just listen to what I'm trying to say. You know, like I haven't lived the fucking the beautifulest life in fucking you know yeah. compared to everyone else. But hey, I'm still out here trying to do my own thing. You know what I mean? Like, just try and listen to the lyrics, you fucking idiots. Yeah, 100%. Not idiots, but... Yeah, no, like, just listen I, to the song, yeah, lad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sit back and, and listen to the words that he's trying to say and, and, and take it in and that, and, and then get upset if he's being real, you know? Yeah. Because, you know, it's better to be real. And from what I gather, bro, you want to be a leader, you want to show people that, that, you know, the streets and all that, it's all BS. You did what you had to do, but... But you want to be conscious and you want to, you know, you want to lead the people to the right path. Or like, you know, the promised yeah. land at least, bro. Like, at least yeah, yeah, give right. people something to, you know. Because yeah. after it's all and dusted, you're just going to be another guy that wrapped about BS and that. Like, that's, yeah, that's yeah. true, you know, because you're going to be like everyone else. It's going to be another guy saying, anyway. get got, get shot. Yeah, yeah get shot, that. get got, got, get shot. Yeah, same thing, man. Look, let's say something else, you know. Yeah, man. Let's rise up together. Let's do something. Let's, you know, let's let's get it. Because there's plenty of money and plenty of things for everyone to, you know. Yeah. Like, don't get me wrong, there are, like, you know, boys in the drill scene that, you know, they've had a tough life. Like, we've all been through the struggle in that, but, yeah. you know, I, I throw no shade at them. You know, even from different areas and that, like, I throw no shade at that kind of shit. I show respect to that because, fuck, you, you're trying to do your thing and try and get out the gutter. You know, even, like, boys from my op area and that, I still sh I show respect in a sense where... I respect your way of trying to get out. Yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah, we beef. Like, yeah, I still got that in the back of my head. Like, fuck, I still don't like you. But, hey, 
you're trying to make your you know you're trying to make your own and try and get up there fuck i respect that because that's a hustle you know what i mean and 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 having said that it's so if that perspective of you and him you might not like each other or you're going through that beef but at the same time you are coming from the same place, that struggle, that common ground, yeah, that yeah. commonality. That same so, thing, bro. So, like, so, the only yeah. thing separating us is just the area shit. Yeah. That's it. So if we but, remove that area stuff... Yeah. Who knows, bro? Everyone from fucking all the areas might get along. You never know, but I yeah, doubt it. Sure. I fucking highly doubt it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Let's be real with that. Yeah, like, yeah. fuck, I highly yeah. doubt that we'll but, ever get along, but hey. Is that got to do with pride, bro, as well? Like, oh, as, as men, like men and stuff, like, it's Fuck, pride, you know? 100%, so if we, man. if we move the arrogance and pride aside and put that stuff aside... Because you'll be in and, heaven. And, <laughs> exactly. You'll be in heaven. That'll go to heaven. Fuck, like, I mean, let's be real. That's like a universal thing in that, whether yeah, you're yeah. biblical or whether what you believe in that. Pride is the most evil thing on this oh, earth. Oh, yeah, that 100%, has, man. You know, destroyed man, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. So, 100, so man. imagine if we just remove that and you come and sit five minutes with your op yeah. and you talk about just like, hey, bro, whatever, you know, this, that, you know, who you grew up with, whatever, this and that, oh, I got this problem and that far, man, you know, you probably have a lot in common more than you think. Yeah, yeah, no, 100%. Yeah. Uh, a lot of us will have a lot in common with each other, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But it's just that I'm from this place, 100%. you're from that place, so yeah, we yeah. can't get along because I, I, I think I run this place, I own this place, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? That, that shit mentality, man. But hey, um, fuck. Everyone will learn on their own, you know? 100%. Everyone will yeah. wake up sooner or later. Yeah, yeah. You can't you can't put them down. I can't put them down because I was that kind of guy, you know what I mean? Like, I'm just glad that I woke up to a fucking bigger picture. You know what I mean? Yeah, bro. I, 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 I really just want to say, like, I'm proud of you, bro. Like, you've come a long way and, you know, to... Because it takes... A man to speak up and 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 tell it how it is, but also to leave what he had, you know, because not many people want to do that, you know, not many people. And you're gonna get comments and people are gonna say this and that and that. But, oh yeah, don't but, get me wrong. But, Even but, though I'm but, trying to get away from that kind of shit, fuck, yeah, I'll yeah. still, I'll fucking still stand my ground and fucking yeah. go at it. You know what I mean? Like I still got that mentality. Like fuck, yeah, you're not yeah. gonna put it on me. Yeah. I'll still fucking go at you. You can't. But but but, but even, uh, even your enemies and. Your thing will give you respect because you're telling it how it is because that's how they feel too. Yeah. And they want to hear that and they, they'll, they'll respect you. So, you know. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, bro. And with us closing now, do you want to say anything else, bro? Like before we... Yeah, uh, fuck. Just, bro, stay true to yourself. You know, keep 100 on the streets and shit. If you're in the game, um, bro, just remember that it's about money. It's not about the street shit, like the street beef and that. You know what I mean? It's strictly about money, making money for your family. Get that money, trying bro. To money, get money, that money. Gutter. Get that money. Get that money. But don't let the money take over your fucking mindset. That's what a lot of you cunts out here tend to do. You know what I mean? They let the money get ahead of them. And then they start forgetting about why they got into the game. So stay true to yourself, you know. Fucking stay staunch. Keep it 100 and fuck it. That's my message. Get that money, bro. Get that money. Stop gambling in that and get that money. Get that money. Don't put it in the machine. Don't slap. Get the money in that. Don't, don't buy bags. Buy yeah, yeah, don't buy things. Just, yeah. you know, yeah, get some clothes, thing and that. Get the money in that. Do what you do, but... Yeah, make sure treat tonight. your family too, you Treat gronks. your family good. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. Fuck. Treat your family good. Go buy mum your, and dad. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. Go buy your sisters and that fucking clothes. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use that money to, yeah, look after your family and stuff like that. Mm. Fill the fridge up, bro, at least. That's all the guys yeah, that are doing yeah. that shit, fuck. Big ups to you, lad. Fuck. That's a real, He's man, a real anyway. one, bro. He's yeah, yeah, a real, real one. That, you know? And yeah, bro. And w- w- so the music's, w- what's next? Like, I mean, you got the single. Is it more music album coming out? Like, is it going to be a tour? Oh, is yeah. it going to be shows? What's. Oh, fuck. No, I haven't thought, you know, shows yet. Like, man, I'm just trying to keep low, just focus on one thing at a time. You know what I mean? Um, I don't want to go too far ahead. Like, go, oh, I'm going to be here now. Fuck. You're thinking like an idiot if you do shit like that. You just take one, st- or so one an idiot. step back. Nah, nah, no, not joking, like that, I'm cause. Joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, <laughs> nah, I'm not like that. No. Like, but no, no, 100%, you know, one step in the moment. In yeah, the moment. Yeah, 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 like now, living in the present. Yeah. Don't go not too far. Hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent. Just yeah. stay grounded. You there know? you go. I didn't know that. I learned something. That's yeah. I'm gonna <laughs> take that into perspective. <laughs> nah, so nah, you know, yeah, yeah, but awesome. Yeah, the music shit. Uh, the Spotify and that. I'm having trouble with that right now, just because of. Old contract that I had signed, 
All right. Yeah. You know, but hey, I'm still working on it. Um, I try to get my music out on Spotify. What happened on the other platforms? What, what, what happened shit? on the contract? Um, yeah, <laughs> that's for another time. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, Spotify. But, hey, yeah. You know, um, oh, I was. Oh, you know what you can do, bro, on Spotify? Just call yourself Hefty. Six one and put like a dot or something, whatever, and then like you know you can get over, it and then that's it. You yeah. break the contract. There you go, bro. Smart. Yeah, no, no, yeah. 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 But I'm trying to sort, we'll sort that out, yeah. and, then, and then you'll get the music on all those platforms. On yeah, yeah. Once. Yeah, it'll get sorted, bro. Get yeah, because uh, a lot of these asking, and um, yeah. this is your answer to the question. There you go. <laughs> I gotta fix some shit that I yeah. done. <laughs> you know what I mean? And uh, but hey, I'm still working on it, man. Uh, don't hate on me you gronks yeah <laughs> alright yeah so there you get it you gronks listen now alright so for what, what we learned from this podcast that that Hefty he's, he's come a long way you know he's still young surprisingly he's still young like you know most of us that are older didn't have that mindset so look at him feel inspired he's come a long way from you know rapping and trapping and doing what he was doing but he he cares, you know. Not many people care and give a thing, you know, because everyone wants to make money, and that's all right. There's nothing wrong with making money in that. But he's got a message in that, and he wants to give it to all of you and that. Please take it on board and just listen to the brother and that, you know. He's he means well. His heart's in the right place, and let's hope everyone can follow suit and and everyone just keep doing it and keep doing you and um just have a good time and just love each other, bro. Just love each other because you know. By the end of the day after it's all said and done and that. You know, we're all going to be gone anyway. And so, you know, it's that's pretty much it, bro. Yeah, in Australia, you know, man. Straight up, bro. Like, you only get one life, you know, and it's not yeah, worth yeah, it, is it, you know? Yeah. Hard, man. No, straight up. It, so. Fuck yeah. In this game, bro, I've had, like, life death situations, you know, yeah. being nice, pulled out on me and that. And uh, I've, I've ran away from, you know, like, fights and that because well, too, many, too many, too yeah, many boys, too many boys were there, too many boys having knives. And they're ready to just do the kill. And look, I'm not ashamed of it. Um, fuck, I'm still here today. They didn't catch me because I'm... Nah, I'm <laughs> but, you know, I'm still here, man. And uh, I just thank God every day for that, you know. And um, this is this is the stuff that you, you kids need to know. Like, But I've gone through a lot of shit where I've caught have been killed. Um, but I've got it now. Like I, I got away from that that moment, like where I was gonna get stabbed and shit. But hey, if you call me a bitch, fuck it. Come meet up. Let's go toe to toe. But I guarantee you, the guy that calls me a bitch, you're a fucking gronk. You haven't been on the streets. Come you down. don't know what this come life down, is bro. about. Come down. You know what I mean? Come down. Come yeah. down. Exactly, I'll force Those guys say, you know, I oh, fucking hate those guys, man. They say, oh, 100%. you're a bitch. You, yeah, yeah, you don't yeah. know this life. Because if I could fucking chuck you into my head and show you all the shit that I've seen, let's see how you would react to the kind of shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, bro. Look, by the end of the day, you don't have to worry about yeah. what he says and yeah. she says and that and that. Like, that's all irrelevant anyway. Like, they're all people talk, bro. People are going to yeah, always yeah, talk yeah. and that, you know. People talk crap. And, bro, before, before we wrap it up, bro, I just want to know, like, um, People want to know because I say online always. Uh, people ask like, "What's your background like? What's your cultural background like?" Oh, you, 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 yeah. fuck! For the last time, I'm Maori. Yeah, yeah, but because people want to know because yeah, because you know, obviously, would, yeah, but yeah. I hang around with a lot of the Tongans in there. Okay. I got mad love. Yeah. Yeah, I got even got mad love for the Samoans. My brother-in-law is Samoan. He's from 27. Yeah, I love that cunt to death. Yeah. I, I love, I love all my, you know. So, and so the people don't know like. What's mold? Is that that's from New Zealand? Is that indigenous from New Zealand? Yeah, indigenous yeah, yeah. New Zealand. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Is that Maori? Ah, uh, is, is Maori. That all, all Maori. Like, is that the same thing? Or yeah, oh, Maori. Ah, no, no, it's Maori. Okay. But right, cool. You know, people call us Maoris. Okay, so Maoris. it's all the same. Okay, all right, cool, cool, all right, cool, bro. So yeah. there you have it. So you call know, us sheep shaggers, but yeah, fuck. bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so New Zealand, um, indigenous and that, but you know, yeah, you yeah. hang out with yeah, Tongans, Samoans, and all that, like all yeah, yeah. All what time? Oh, so, so, got mad love for them, you know, even the Fijians and that. Yeah, all yeah. The polis. So, so, so all the polis, that. Yeah, so, yeah. so it's all one. So yeah, you're a universal yeah. person. I don't see, yeah, I don't see yeah. Maldives just here, and then all the islanders there. I will see all, all of one. us as islanders. All. Yeah, yeah. 100%. You know, I will see us all as one. Yeah, we're all brown. Fuck. 
Exactly. <laughs> hey, man, look, I'm yeah, late with that. I'm, I'm just like, hey, bro, I'm moldy too, bro. So yeah, there you straight go, bro. Up. So, yeah, straight up, bro. Yeah, that's what's yeah, up. Yeah, man. Awesome. All right, bro. Well, that's it. Well, thank you, bro. Hefty for Cheers, man. coming on um, 100% from the area and that. You know, yeah, like no, nah, no. Nah, thanks for having me. You know, bro, second, second time, second time on the show, bro. So that's a record, bro. So <laughs> you have the record for that, bro. Yeah, second time, bro. Yeah, nah, thanks for having me, man. Bro. Straight and, up, um, mad love, know, man. We hope your career goes up, bro, and, yeah, nah, and thanks, you keep bro. doing your thing and inspiring that, bro. It's really good, bro, to see that you're doing something good, bro. So really, nah, nah, straight really up, thanks good, for that, eh? You know, like I'm really proud of you, bro. So it's good, bro. Nah, Honestly, straight up, respect, bro. All right, man. All right, guys, peace in that, and take care. See ya, bye.